Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Technotalks here. So in today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the Spigen Glass TR Easy Fit Tempered Glass Screen Protector for the iPhone 15 Pro. So I've been using Spigen's Glass TR Easy Fit Screen Protectors for the past two generations of iPhones with my 13 Pro and also my 14 Pro and now with the 15 Pro. And so far, it's just been a great screen protector. It's easy to apply. You get two for only $16.99 and it's also super simple and super nice to use. So without further ado, let's go ahead and open this up. Starting off the packaging, we can see that we do get a nice little package right here. We can see what it looks like. We get the name, speaking logo up top. And on the back, we do get some information like easy installation, real glass, obviously, oleophobic coating, 9-inch surface hardness, and speaking case friendly. And also I've noticed with my previous easy fit glass uh, screen protectors that it does work with other cases as well. So it doesn't have to be a speaking case. Opening it up from the bottom, we are immediately revealed with our two screen protectors. If I can manage to pull them out, here they are. And we don't get anything else inside of this box, which we can just move to the side real quick. All right. And now taking a look at what we get inside, we have two screen protectors. We have a nice little installation guide. And thank you for choosing Spigen. And we also do get a nice little tool to take out the bubbles which is actually different from the previous versions. The previous versions were a little larger. This one's more, uh, I guess this is easier to use rather than using it with the other tool. And then we also do get another insulation guide. So you do get two for the two screen protectors, which also come in these trays. So it's super easy to line up, no issues with that either. And we also do get a nice little kit, which probably has all of the things that we need to use for this installation. So, all right, we get two, Lens and cleaning screen, uh, screen, lens and screen cleaning wipes. We get a nice microfiber cloth. We do get our dust removal stickers. Again, we do get a set of two. We get a set of two screen protectors, and we also do get two insulation guides with one tool to air out uh, the screen protector if you do have any air bubbles left. So let me go ahead and quickly organize this area right here for the insulation, and I'll go ahead and get back to you. All that we have everything set in place, we can go ahead and bring start with the installation. So first up. What I recommend and what is always recommended is to actually power off your device so it doesn't constantly turn on when you're applying the screen protector and it kind of distracts you. So that's what we're gonna first do. Go ahead and power off our device. Now let's go to move our screen protector to the side and actually go ahead and grab our lens and screen cleaning wipe. And for anyone wondering, here is a quick look at the installation guide, a closer look at least. So plopping that to the side as well. Let's go to move everything else out of the way and grab our phone and lens and screen cleaning wipe. All right, so let's go ahead and grab that. Go ahead and wipe down our display real quick. This is a very new phone, so it'll probably be clean, but again, it's always better to do this. And I would also recommend applying a screen protector right after you get your device. I've been using my phone for around two days now, so it's gotten a little dirty, but again, just go ahead and place it on top right away as iPhone scr uh, screens do scratch up pretty fast and easily, which is something that I've noticed and which is why I recommend a screen protector with these devices. All right, moving that to the side, we can now go ahead and wipe our phone with the microfiber cloth. Go ahead and get this dry. And next up, we are gonna be using our dust removal stickers so that we can actually remove that dust if we do have any dust. And also try to be in a dust-free environment. And I've said this in previous videos as well, uh, applying a screen protector is super easy to do when you do it in the shower after you've run the shower with hot water as the steam actually collects the dust and I saw this in a Mr. Who's the Boss video. So, taking our sticker, all we have to do is just check the areas that we have dust. And again, you can have some issues with this. You might have one particle, two particles, but usually that is fine. As long as you try and get everything out of there, it should be fine. There can be some human error, but again, as I said, it should be perfectly fine. So it does seem like our phone is perfectly good now and very clean. And now that we have gotten all the dust off, I'm going to go ahead and use our screen protector. So first we have to remove the back so it actually can apply onto the phone. Once you go ahead and do that, you'll want to go ahead and immediately set it on top of your phone. And all you have to do is just press down and it's on there and now what we have to do is press and slide and wait around 30 seconds for this to finish. So I'm gonna flip this over. Again, as I said, press and slide, wait 30 seconds. So let's go ahead and wait for this. 
and I've actually applied that. And as you can see, very simple installation. Basically, I had nothing to do. And again, as always, very nice. I really love and enjoy using this screen protector as it just makes it so easy. So continuing to wait for this, it says remove from here. All we have to do is pull this tab and everything else should be fine. So you necessarily don't have to wait 30 seconds, but if you wanna be perfect, then go ahead and wait for it. But I'm gonna go ahead and remove it right now. It seems like everything is on there. All we have to do is pull this sticker. So pulling it backwards, boom, moving this out of the way now, and then just push down. Here is our screen protector. So all we have left is this tray right here, and we can actually go ahead and air out, actually take this sticker off. And we do have some air bubbles left. So all we have to do is just push these out. And again, there can be some human air. So trying to get these bubbles out, got the bottom ones out. And it seems like we don't have any dust particles in there, just some applying issues, trying to get that as well. As you can see, we do have some bubbles on the inside, which will actually take a little harder to get out if we can manage to get them out. And it seems like we're almost there. So again, very nice and easy installation. So if you do fail on the first try, like I kind of did, it's not really a fail. I do have two tiny bubbles in here, but again, if you really want to have it perfect, then you also do have a second screen protector. I wouldn't recommend opening it up just for these tiny bubbles, which seem like they've gone as well. So no more bubbles. But again, if you really do want it to be perfect, then you can go ahead and do that. So now let's wipe it down one more time and then go ahead and get it wiped down with a microfiber cloth. And here is our phone. So pristine installation, very nice and clean. Seems like our display is perfectly fine except for this tiny peck speck right there and that speck right there. But other than that, this looks super nice. So it's all around the display, it goes above the face ID as well. Your face ID works, everything works fine. Uh, your speaker grill is not covered up top. And again, it just feels really nice, just like the display. So no issues with that. And if you do go ahead and place your case on here, it should work perfectly fine. So again, as you saw, that was a very simple installation. Uh, all I had to do was just wipe it down and put the tray down. And if we do go ahead and test out face ID, just to show you guys, face ID does work. So no issues with that either. Again, that is gonna be the Spigen Easy Fit Glass TR uh, Tempered Glass Cream Protector installation. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this solves any issues if you do have any problems with installing the screen protector. But other than that, that'll basically wrap it up for this video. So as always, if you did enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe and see y'all in the next one.